Hey guys, today me and my mom are going plant shopping in Salt Lake. They posted a begonia, what's it called? A begonia maculata on Instagram. So we headed out here first thing to pick one up because <laughs> my mom's been wanting one and I figured if she's gonna get one, I'm gonna get one too and we might as well make some more plant pit stops. So here we are, let's go. There she is. I don't know which one I want. Can I give it to dad for his birthday? <laughs> oh my gosh, that one has a huge leaf. Look what we found without even planning. I hope I read. Do you think this would be hard for me to keep alive? It's a ficus. It would be hard. I've had one of those before and I killed it. Really? Yeah. It has to be in a terrarium or something. It's so cute. Oh, look at the hibiscus. Oh my gosh. Whoops. Oh my gosh. Harley. Back around this way and then... Oops. <laughs> Do you want to go back around that way and make a loop? Okay. What are these? That one looks sad. What is it? I don't know. But it's cute. Oh, a natal mahogany. Oh, that? That Nick Poet. I don't know how to say his name. Nick, the guy on YouTube. He posted a video about these. Oh. And it made me want one really bad. Okay. I like those ones, but they would be awkward, I feel like. You know? I like awkward things, though, like you hardly. The most. <laughs> I really want it. I Guess how much it is. How much? 125. Uh, dang, though. Do you think what? I think you should uh, go. <laughs> <laughs> That's awkward. I still want more. What? No matter how many Monstera I get, I still want more. Again. You ready to go to the next one? We also are taking a pit stop at the Draper Cactus and Tropicals location just to kind of see the difference in the varieties they have. And there was also a plant there that I really wanted when we went on our little road trip my mom posted a video about. So we're going there to pick that up. Let's go. Here she is. I'm so excited. Are you having fun? I can't remember. Oh my gosh. Okay. We drove all the way to freaking Draper for this plant. Yes. We're back out and I got some plants. My mom surprisingly didn't. They didn't have as many plants here, but I think it's because they got their shipment in in the Salt Lake location and then they, they bring the rest of them here at the end of the week. I could be wrong about that. I swear I saw that on Instagram though, but. Okay, so my mom is dropped off at home. I'm just headed home. I did find a lot of really, really good plants that I'm super excited about. Can you see some of the plants in the back? So I'm back from the shopping trip to cac two Cactus and Tropical stores. I did end up buying a lot of plants. 
We originally ended up going because they posted that they were getting begonia maculata plants in stock today and we didn't want to miss out on them so we rushed right there first thing in the morning when they first opened and we ended up finding a lot of other really cool plants so let me show you everything I got. So I guess first I'll show you the begonia which is the plant we initially went there for. Oh it's so beautiful. The leaves are a lot more succulent than I was expecting. I hope I can keep this guy alive. Now more than ever I need care advice. I want this guy to be alive and not only be alive but to thrive. Please leave them in the comments. Um, next I also got this type of Hoya. We aren't exactly sure what variety of Hoya this is. The buyer didn't wasn't even sure what type it is. It's really unique. I haven't personally seen one like this before. So if any of you Hoya heads know what this baby is, please let me know. I would really, really appreciate it. I've been kind of expanding on my Hoya collection lately. So this will be a really nice one to add. It's going to look really cute hanging from the ceiling. Next up is this really cool peperomia. I want to say this one's called a Rana Verde. It isn't labeled though, so I could be wrong. It reminds me a lot of a Pilea peperomoides, but it's more rippled, really cool, really unique. I had to pick it up. I've never seen them in a large pot size like this. And yeah, I really, really like this one. On that same note, I got another peperomia. This one is an emerald rip, or not an emerald. This one is a ripple peperomia, but the variegated version. I've never seen this available in stores before before so I just had to pick it up. I've been not only adding to my Hoya collection but also my Peperomia collection. Now that I have their care needs down I've just really been enjoying collecting them and this one is so cool and so unique. I just love the foliage. Variegated anything is really cool in my opinion and everybody's opinion I think. <laughs> I'm really excited about the next one. Next up is this baby a Monstera? What did he tell me to call it? Peru. Monstera Peru. Yes I actually bought <laughs> One, two, <laughs> and three. <laughs> I know, a little excessive. I can't help it. I, I can't help it. I did this because one of them is for me and then I plan to do a plant giveaway here soon. I'm just preparing for that. So be on the lookout for a giveaway of these guys coming up real quick. I'll be announcing it as well as showing all of the prizes in an upcoming video. I'm just not sure when it's going to go up. But yes, I bought three. We went in there not expecting for these to be there. It was just a happy coincidence. So I'm really glad with how that turned out. I hope you guys are excited for the giveaway for those. And then the last plant I bought today is this Stromanth Trio Star. I think that's what this one is. We drove to the Draper location for this one. 10 inch pot, really beautiful. I've been wanting to add this guy to my collection. I got one from Hertz a while back and it just was not in good condition to begin with. So there was really no salvaging it for me because I guess I'm not that talented at salvaging plants, but where this one is already in healthy condition, I think it'll do really well. The way I've been taking care of the rest of my Calatheas and Stromanth and Marantas and all the prayer plant kind of varieties that I have in my house. That is everything I picked up. Please let me know what you thought of everything. Any care tips as usual, I really appreciate it. And thank you so much for watching. I will see my next one.